Hey guys, Craig with Reflections Exterior Services. Uh, we're here in Rehoboth Beach, and this is actually a follow-up video I uh, posted last year, last time we were here doing the same job, and actually wanted to give you an inside view of how to clean an enclosed porch. And again, just a couple little handy tips uh, to keep in mind. So this is the scenario. We've got an enclosed, screened-in, second-story porch. As you can see, there's no outside access whatsoever. Um, and the customer basically just kind of wants to rinse down the walls. Uh, it's really not that bad, but there's, there's you know, typical dirt and grime that, that blows in through the screens that they want rinsed off. So again, the challenge is getting your setup out there uh, into here. So uh, just a couple things that we've done. Uh, we noticed that one of the outlets here <clears throat> is supposed to look like that with the uh, with the plastic cover does not have the plastic cover uh, the lamp was plugged into it so we've gone ahead and again used our our three mil uh, or 3m I should say safe release tape uh, to try to prevent any water from getting in there but then as you can see we have our hose uh, already kind of pre-measured out here and what we've done is we started on the inside and we've taken this hose around and up through uh, a neighboring window. And just as an added touch here, we just took a, a heavy duty uh, paper towel and placed it right here so as not to have this mark up the wall or mark up the trim. Again, you just wanna be mindful of that sort of thing. If you got guys working for you, you wanna make sure they take that extra step so as not to have an issue later. But the other important thing, uh, like I mentioned in the other video, is that you do not want to have a quick connect um, anywhere in this stretch. So, you know, you have a quick connect go bad, you have an O-ring bust all of a sudden, and it's inside somebody's home, problem. <laughs> so again, give some forethought as to the length of hose that you need um, to make sure that you can have a continuous run basically from your, from your porch all the way through and just make sure that all your connect connections are either inside the porch or outside uh, the window. So again, just a, a quick tip. Sometimes this can be a very awkward situation, but start from the inside, work your way out. Uh, yeah, just take that little extra step and um, hopefully that helps. So yep, Craig with Reflections, have a great day, take care.